Gru is a character who is always trying to do something dastardly. And frankly, I think that despicable people don't get the kind of uh, credit that they deserve. I wanna be evil. We stole the Statue of Liberty, the small one from Las Vegas. He has assistants Listen up, please. called minions. They're tiny. Dave? Not cool. I wanna be wicked. He wants to be the best at being bad, but Gru's arch enemy, Vector, oh, yeah. is upstaging him, and he doesn't like it a bit. <laughs> he shrink, right? No! I hate that guy. It becomes a bit of a feud between the two of us as to who will be the reigning supervillain. We are going to pull off the true crime of the century. We are going to steal the moon! And all of a sudden, three girls find themselves working their way into his life. You will not cry or sneeze or barp or fart. No annoying sounds. Does this count as annoying? In the beginning, he definitely seems like he's not going to be the perfect dad. Where did you get that? <laughs> and then he ends up really shining and showing that he can be. Three little kittens started to yawn. Now make them drink the milk. Wow, this is garbage. You actually like this? <laughs> Something about these three sweet kids. They tap into Gru. It's the power of love. Despicable Me in eye-popping 3D. <laughs> That was awesome. Be so fluffy, I'm gonna die! All you gotta do is knock down that spaceship there. Aww. Oh, somebody's got a frowny face. Okay, my turn. Knocked over! It's so fluffy! This big guy. This big. This big. This. This. Despicable me.